Yeah. You win the class? Yeah. All right. We're back. We're back. All right. Yeah, we are the live already. <laughs> so, what's that thing here? I don't know. I don't get it. So, it's a home of buses. I'll find out, don't worry. Umpire Poyer, you know, big up to Umpire Poyer, you know, he went home and bed, he put on a long pants, but he still have on the slippers, <laughs> big him up, yeah, we don't show you, no shoes, no shoes, no shoes, only slippers, only slippers, so, right now, Umpire Poyer is ready, who's the other umpire? Oh, oh. all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. So, big up umpire Kion, and he's in his slippers as well. These umpires on them, they have no training, they have no etiquette. I know you didn't come here for that, but just, just go with the flow. <laughs> just yes, go go with the flow, go with the flow. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Community is a love. Um, I want to find out the next. I want to find, what is the next team name? You know the next team name? Upsetters. Upsetters? But I will find out. So, ladies and gentlemen, um, we're right here at the Hermitage, Hermitage and playing field for the Tag Team Sports Entertainment 1010 Cricket, well, Windball Cricket Tournament. Right here. Right. So. All right, let me, let, me, let, me, let me go and interview the um, yes, yes, yes. other team. Hey, bro, why is all your team name? You can't remember, so that the captain here? Yeah? Let me check the captain. Captain! Captain, why is your team name? Upsetters. So we have the upsetters here. They won the toss and they chose to bat. I think it's, this game is going to be a very exciting game. I see a lot of key players here, experienced players on this field here today. Tonight. Um, it's going to be great. So ladies and gentlemen, don't be afraid to share the live stream. We're right here at the Hermitage playing field. And if you're anywhere in close proximity of the Hermitage playing grounds, you can just come on, you know, just come through and, and have, a, have, a, have a blessed time. Because um, we had a little bit of rain, but you know, they say rain only stop cricket, but when rain done, cricket could play again. Anyways, all the share the live. Don't be bad. Be good. Be good people. All right? So I'm about to go up in the stands where I respectively belong. To carry these games. 
Yes, Lord. Right. Yes, Lord. With your engine. Everybody mount up with my bottle. What? <laughs> What's wrong? You close, please. Hey. Mm -hmm. yeah. What's wrong with you? I mean, that's what do you. Grown adults dress like that. I'm making a hat. See them, just see them and the rest of them. <laughs> yes, so we have a um a homer coming up against upsetters. A homer coming up against uh, upsetters. Opening the batting for upsetters. We have we have Mason and Frank. Mason and Frank opening the bowling. For a homer, we have Che. Spearman. So we are back here live at the Hermitage playing field. The stands are filled to capacity. We have 90,000 people in the stands here tonight. Well attended events. The most we have ever had in any tournament, any competition. Don't forget to share the life. Yes, so back to the cricket, back to the cricket. We are taking a lot of break. What from our sponsors, our sponsors, we must big up Carib. We must big up Modern Dental Care. Total Auto. Belmont Estate. <laughs> As she, with the second ball in and boot, missed his run up. To Che, to Mason. Che, Mason. White ball signaled by the umpire. So it's a dead start to the game. The teams are not yet settled. The eyes are not yet adjusted to the light. Che, Mason. Well, well yeah, he Che to Mason. But Che, Che, Duncan into... Che to Mason. So Che, Mason. Finishing the over. Finishing the over. So it seems that there is a, a bit of problem there with the opening bowler from a homer. Seems like he didn't warm up properly. So Stafford into Mason and outside the stump. Well taken there by the keeper. So welcome one, welcome all. Remember we are streaming live on Facebook and Twitter. Brendan Blazer, shopping like a razor. Even if you're in the past yeah, and you want to look at the game live, you're streaming to Brendan. Brendan Blazer, shopping like a razor. And that's the first six of the evening. Whipped over mid wicket, six rounds. Yeah. 
So that's the fourth bond group. Six rooms. So after this game, we have Latouche coming up against Yo Yo. Um, up, up top Blazers. That's our scheduled game. And that's a run out. Brilliant run out. He took his time and aim. That's a run out. Brilliant walk there from Dasset. He had to aim at three stops. Well, at one stop. And he managed to run the batsman out. So upset us. So remember guys, check out the bar. We also have chicken and chips on sale. So check out the stands. Check out the bar. Yes, so handle again. Runs in. The ball. And wild swing. Well missed. Well judged there by the keeper. <laughs> yes, I. Second over. Remember, guys, within the V in the power play, it's a free hit. It was a no ball, it's a free hit. Signaled by the umpire. Let us see if the batsman can capitalize. And, and it's a wide, yeah. yeah. It's another free, it's a wide. So the free hit remains. Let us see if the batsman can make use of that delivery. Remember, he cannot, and he pulls that. Six runs, and it's another six here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I walk in. I walk in. <laughs> Are they easy? Yes, so we are back to the cricket live here. And it's an opportunity for a catch, it's an opportunity for a run out. Oh, that was brilliant there. That was great improvisation from, 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 from Che. But not out, says the umpire. I know Che is a, is a good footballer. He's a good goalkeeper and he's showing off his, his football skills here. Wow, excuse me. Oh, 
Trust me, that look good. In the game of football, that will surely be a goal. <laughs> but remember, Che, you're playing cricket. We have to look for wicket, not goals. So, Sire, former Winwood Island national player. Remember, it's all about tags, entertainment, 10-10, win ball, soccer, 10-10, tournaments. Yes, sorry for the breaking transmission. We are trying to stop out something here at the commentary booth. Trying to get the proper signal so we can transmit properly. So we can be clear to the viewing public. So we are back here live. Upsetters coming up against Ahoma. It seems like Upsetters looking to upset Ahoma. But so far it's not looking good. Seems like a home and take the, the Daika and the Inu. The stomach good or they take a, 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 a eat a river, drink something, they drink something for the stomach. Yeah man, some gobba ball. How am I losing tonight? Is it you? My team is tonight. Yes, yes, so where is the Ahoma fans? I'm not hearing the Ahoma fans. Ahoma fans, they are dead tonight, man. You tell you what, Shari? No, man, I took it, man. Big up yourself. 
free up yourself. Make nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Handle again. <laughs> oh, and that split up the pads. That's gone. That's six rooms. Six rooms for upsetters. Let go of Six rooms from Felix. That's a good shot. The, bat, the bowler was on the pads. And he flicked. And he swings, it's high into the night sky. Sire, yeah. safe field into the safe hands of Dennis John. And another wicket goes down. Another wicket goes down. It seems like this game will be over in a flash. <laughs> wicket are falling at the regular intervals. And they are not adding to the total. It's 26, 26 after, after 2.4 overs, they are still scoring at a run rate of 12.2, but they are losing wicket very quickly. We want to big up all the fans, all the spectators, all the well-wishers. Those who are viewing live on Facebook and Twitter, those who are viewing from the home, pick up yourself. So we are bringing the cricket into your homes. Pandel again. Stafford. Cool. Runs in again. And he swings, but this one is a corner. This one is six rows. And it's a one and catch taken on the bleachers. But remember, if you, are, if you catch the ball with your mouth, you get $500. So we are, tell, we are asking players, try and, um, spectators, to try and catch the ball with your mouth. $500 up for grabs. Seems like I, I, I miss an exciting part of the game. Babe. That's Bravo doing Bravo, Darren Bravo. Feeling on the point boundary. Seems like he slept and fell. I don't know how that, that can feel because when you look at Bravo, the size of Bravo, he's an enormous figure. End up over number three. Hmm? It's 32 for three. Up top. And upsetters, they are scoring at a rate of 11. At a run rate of 11 for over. So we have Toby. And he swings. But well feel it, they know they are sleeping here, they are sleeping here. We are asking the Oma team to wake up. They are sleeping here, man. They are sleeping. You know the grass wet. But they are sleeping as not S L I P P S L W P I N D. Right ball signal there. So it's a one to the total, a study tree. Boom, boom, shock you. Tommy, and he swings. And they go to for a quick single. That's 34. In 3.2 overs. Yeah. Upset as they are looking to upset the Ahoma team here, one of the best teams on the island in, in Windmore cricket. They are playing in numerous tournaments. I have seen them play before and I'm telling you, it's a, they are an experienced team. 
Oh, good thing of Whitney from Rusty. Swing and a miss. But, well, Chubby, uh, Rusty, Chubby, same, same family, one family. So it's a Rusty Chubby. Oh, Chubby Rusty. Chubby again. And he swings. Miss. Ricochet of the pad. And then they go to for a leg by. So it's 35. 35 rounds. Rusty. Chubby again. And he swings. Well stopped there by the wicket keeper. Yeah, the umpire changed. Umpire have done a long punch now on our slippers. <laughs> a national player. It's a bear and bullet. Very experienced captain. I mean, when you look at the Homer team, we have a very experienced team. But from my observation, I see that the upsetters, the batsmen, they are just looking to swing to the line. You know, they are not watching the ball. Onto the bat, they are just swinging to the line, hoping to connect. But they are homer bowlers, they are well experienced. And they are keeping it in line. Good line, good length. That's what experience can do to you. Just want to pick up the umpires, Kendall Joseph, Kian Joseph. Want to pick up the sponsors also. Total Auto Automotive. Total Automotive. We have. Why that man here in the boot? Estate. Why that man here in the boot and he don't, boot, he don't say nothing? Put him out of the boot, man. No, no. Yeah, man, come out in the boot. Yeah, yeah, go. <laughs> That's a great shot. That's a lovely shot. The six rounds. That's 112 meters. That's one of the biggest six we have seen for the day. He launches at that one with all his power, all his figure, all his might. As we have Ted Roy, it's a better run. Play cricket. Yeah, I got bullish. Again. And there's a nick well taken by Darren. Another wicket goes down. The upsetters, they are losing wicket very quickly. They are just flashing at everything that comes away. We have Redman going on all the way from Australia, I believe. Upset has brought him in. He's a very experienced champion. They brought him all the way from Australia. Um, we are asking somebody from the Upsetters team to please check the commentary booth. So someone from the Upsetters team who knows the players very well, please check the commentary booth. We need some information from you guys. So check us down here at the commentary booth. We need your help. Upsetters, don't really. upsetters, are you upset? Don't be upset. Don't be upset with me at all, at all, at all. That's my job. They pay me to talk. You know? So, we need all your help. Are you hungry, the party? Well, we have chicken and chips at the bar. We also have kalalu soup. Fish, fish and chips. Terry again. Oh! No, a people caught behind. 
only the keeper that went up. The, the bowler was not interested. And I was telling you they brought in this guy for all the way from Australia. I think I think his name is um, David Warner. And he flicks on the leg side as they go through for a quick single, you know. But I, I, I'm kind of wondering if it's dogs and a homer that he's feeling because the, the pack is filled with so many dogs. And then we're asking the neighbors, who, you know, please tie your dogs. Please watch your dogs. No pass here. I mean, there are so many dogs on the field. I mean, I have. Yeah, I intel that's an intelligent dog. He does well trained. Double zag. So they two dogs. Yeah, speak up yourself. You dog, big up yourself. <laughs> Yeah, he's going electronically. He's going on the phone. So we have Chubby again. At the top of his mark. Runs in, long run up. Goes past the umpire. Bowling to Red Manor. It's a white signal there by the umpire. White signal. We know that the Jew is playing a, a, a part in the fielding here tonight. The balls are getting wet very quick. So it is important to win the toss. Yeah, because the later you go into the night, the Jew will play a, a great part, a great effect into the game on how it rolls out. And they attempt a quick single chair and shy at the stumps. Want to pick up every family present here tonight, all the young kids. Down the leg side, white signal there by the umpire. You know, we are seeing that the umpire is, is scoring from his phone, but sometimes we, you know, we are wondering if the umpire is not watching the game live on Facebook. But we want to encourage the umpire. I mean, you are seeing the game live here, no need to watch it on Facebook again. <laughs> Trying to give us a lot of views here, man. That's good, that's good, though. You're supporting me, thank Kian. Well done. Big up yourself, big up yourself. Toby again, back to the cricket, into bowl to David Warner. And David Warner knows nothing. Now, this one was tucked into the body, and he has no answers when the ball has been tucked into the body. He cannot play the ball on the body. And I believe that, that Chubby, Chubby Pigaro, that very early, so he's putting the ball into the body. <laughs> Chubby again. And he swings. That one kept low, but well, well collected there by Baron. So what? The, it's 45 for, for, for four. In 4.4 overs. Heading to the... And that's a great shot. That's an Australian shot. I'm telling you. I've seen this on, on TV before. That's an Australian shot. The way he stepped forward. Ball. Body. Body over the ball. Six runs. That's the replay. Just look at me. Anybody want to see the replay? Just look at me. Six runs. He's, he was well balanced. This is one for the camera. I, I hope that Blazer Shackle like a razor had this one on the, on the live there. Yeah, man. We should I do a, 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 a screenshot? Can you do a screenshot on the live? Yep. Yeah, right. <laughs> Trust me, this one look good. We need to pose that. Uh, what the was? Oh, 
Yes, back to the cricket. Let us see that David Warner can repeat this shot. If he can replicate. And he strives again, but this one is along the ground. Well fielded there by Handel. He suddenly stopped a, a, a four. And they go to for a quick single. I believe that David Warner is starting to see the ball as big as a breakfast. Right now his eyes is open, he's in. So he's making good connection. Chubby into ball two. And that's all. That's a drop catch. It was a difficult chance. It was a half chance. And if he had held on to this one, it would be a magnificent catch. There from Deran Hippolyte. Remember we have, this is a homer against upsetters. After this, we have Latouche coming up against Octa Ballers, Octa Blazers, sorry. So at the end, at the end of five overs, we have 52. After six overs, we have 52 for four. 52 for four. Tedroy again. Oh, and an edge down to third man. And they go to for a quick single. I'm telling you, they didn't want to start to see that ball as big as a breakfast. He's getting in. He has played himself in. And we have seen the result. You know, when you go there and you play yourself in, you can always make up for the balls that was lost earlier on. But the, the upsetters, batsman, the earlier batsman, they just went in there and decided to just go at ball one. And by doing that, in the process, they lost the wicket. It's another good single again from, from upsetters. That is good cricket. When you cannot get the boundary, you look for the single, you look for the twos. Go to the big one. Oh, it's a good delivery. Bounce from a good length. But David Warner should be accustomed with this bounce pitch. Because Australia is known for quick wickets and bouncy wickets. That's a great shot. He went back on the back foot, but straight to the mid on fielder. Well fielded there by Che. A homer seems to be on top of things. They are restricting the scoring. An upset that needs to push the scoring on. They are swinging, but not making connection with the deliveries. I think that they need to go back to the nets. So at the end of over number seven, the score is 54. 54 for 4. Yeah. 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 So they are scoring at a rate of 9 and over. Yeah. 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 So basically it's eight, eight and over. My bad, my correction. Eight and over. Yeah, but it's going, it's going at eight and over. Yeah, 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 yeah no, don't know. So it's a wide, wide signal. So it's 65, another to the tally. The extras are summing up here. A woman needs to be more disciplined. Oh, that was an excellent delivery. Ahoma is known for the duck down and sire. He's very experienced when bowling the duck down. The batsman was totally deceived by this delivery. Sire again, very experienced. Outside the off stump. No shot played.
Woman, woman's applying the pressure on upsetters here. We are creating a lot of pressure on the batsman. And I believe, you know, you. That's the opener. No, no. <laughs> and that's going to the side, a point of going to the left side, and he failed to capitalize on this. But it's a white signal there. That should have not been falling in the in the in the parking lot. But he failed to 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 hit that one. I'm starting to wonder if if that batsman is actually seeing the ball go inside it. I think the batsman have to remember this is a 10-10 game, it's not a test match. You're not coming back here tomorrow night and resume your eating. Yeah, I don't know. And it's a six, six rounds. I think he heard me. That's good coaching there from you, um, commentator. That's six rounds, six rounds. He immediately opened his eyes. And this was a gone of six. Oh, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this guy, he's listening to me. That's a great shot. That's one of the best shots I've seen here. On the back foot, two points. And that's a brilliant, brilliant, brilliant shot. Very expansive, very controlled. The man on the point boundary, he was right there and couldn't even make a move. No man moved. Nobody get hurt. Dennis George, again, that's a good over for upsetters. I think we got about 12 or 13 from this over. 12. Good over there from upsetters. So we are into the ninth over, I believe. One left, one left. We are into the ninth over. So after eight overs, upsetters are 66 for four. So they're scoring at eight and over. So they are scoring at eight and over. Currently, that's the current run rate. I think they would need to push that run rate if they want to go up, get a competitive total because you know the, the ability of the Ahoma team. You know, we have Darren Hippolyte, we have um, Aswal, we have Handel, we have Dennis George, we also have Vass, we have Bravo. Oh, and it's an opportunity for a catch. It's a good catch. Is it? No, it's four rounds, it's a drop catch. It's a drop catch. That was an opportunity for a wicket. He did all the hard work, but was unable to hold on to it. Zidane again. That was a slower delivery. That was extremely slow. That was extremely slow, but the batsman was not able to connect. Zidane. I think David want us to play some jumping shot. He's warming up jumping jacks. I think he's doing some jumping jacks. Yeah, man. He needs to play cricket. Let's go see that. See that again. Oh! Great bit of work there from, from the umpire. That out, says the umpire. TV Empire, we have a review for Stump. Give me your best side on you, please. We've got to go back to the camera. 
I have already checked the front foot. It's a legal delivery. Can you roll, roll, roll? Not out. I got a big screen. Yay! You see that again at the top of his mat. And to bowl to David Wana. And swings. Straight to the final leg. Killed up. And there was a little white, white signal there by the umpire. It seems like I'm seeing it doubles here too, man. It's a wide, so it's another one to the total. My other man, no, no. Hey. It's 71. Hey. And Zida, he's very deceptive as, a bowl, uh, deceptive as a bowler. He's bowling a lot of slow ones, a lot of quick ones. So it's hard to pick, and the batsmen, they are not picking it up properly. And that's one of the qualities of the Ahoma bowlers. They are very deceptive. So we have the last over in this inning, the final over in this inning. I think that upsetters need to put on the, put the foot on the pedal on the pedal on the gas if they want to get a competitive score. We like to big up Gang Nine, Gang Nine Williams. Big up yourself. Is that Fletcher? Andre Fletcher? Oh. Right, that's Andre Fletcher, guys. Andre Fletcher was in this open batsman. So Darren he pull it. We'll continue at the peg leg end. Darren. And that's a wide ball signal there by the umpire. Darren would have to reload this one. It was slow. 66. So Darren. Oh, and that's six. And it's a no ball. Six rounds. That one was short and slow. And number 71, he was equal to the task. 71 and it flashes but they are not running the single i believe that upsetters need to get as much rules as possible they are not running the singles they are not playing good cricket at the moment they need to run the singles they need to put the fields man under pressure cause them to make mistakes but they are just sitting back on the bats and he swings this one down to the And it's a no ball, it's a free hit. It's an opportunity for David Warner to put this one away. Remember, in a free hit, you cannot be out. Only the only way you can be out is by run out. Right, good. It's a wide ball. So we have to reload this one. 
He will have to reload this one, so it's the free hit remains. The free hit remains. <laughs> it seems like he's having some problem with the bowling arm. It's another no ball. The free hit still remains. And it's a wild throw there from Spearman. Well, the batsman, the batsman is down also. Well, this is an injury. Ah, speak out. I find everybody an injury. I think we need to call the, um, the paramedics, um, the, the physio, physio for the home team and also for the um, upsetters team. Please check the, your players. Everyone is suffering from some sort of injury. Seems like he's suffering from some cramps. So I believe we have about two more deliveries left in this inning. I said about. So it's another, you see, I wasn't wrong, I wasn't wrong. That was right. So there and again. And he tries to flick this one to the middle of the area. And it's another delivery. So this, this over is very lengthy. It is very lengthy. But it don't make you run any lengthy over, so it don't make sense. Exactly. And that's the end of the over. That's the end of the of the inning. It's 85. It's 85 at the end of 10 overs. Of setters of 85 to defend. Let us see if they can pull this one up. Oh, no, of setters of 85 to defend. A home of 86 to get. 86 in 10 overs. They need to score at least 8 point four oh four for over. 8 point two four five six seven eight nine ten for over. So as we look, we can see that the bleachers is getting filled. We want to big up Doc. Big up yourself. I'm a partner, Doc, all the way from poetry. Big up yourself, Doc. What about you, baby? Oh. Our oh, my supporters just touched down. The lakes. Yes, I'm calling you. Where you come from? Okay, go back. Come on.
and so on the boxes um we provide garbage bags so you can put it in the um in the garbage bag instead of putting it in the school bin um put it in the garbage bag so we can dispose it properly or we put it in the um in the, uh, in the, field, the dog will show it down and create a mess so we ask you guys so please 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 please, please, please i say please comply put it in the garbage bags we will dispose it properly, all right? Thank you very much. Mr. DJ, as you're about to resume the second inning. Second inning between upsetters and a homer. Yeah, man. 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 Y
Yes, so we can resume now. The bowler name, the bowler name. Yes, 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 we can proceed. Bola me. Right. So we get that. Simon Philip, Simon Philip. So Philip into Stafford. Felix into Stafford. Felix into Stafford. So let's go. Play. Felix into Stafford. Oh, that's a quick delivery there from the young staff. It's a good start to the inning. That was a 90 and 90.1, 90 90.1. That was very quick and that was his first delivery. I can imagine when he's won. Whoa, that's spacey, bouncy. Well handled there by Handel. Handel is very experienced. Stafford is a very experienced campaigner. He had played cricket all over the wall, all over Grenada. Even played in Carico, Pitimatnik, and the rest of the Eastern Caribbean. Union Island. Yes. Yes, I'm telling you. He also played Calibini Island. Isla Rune. He has played cricket in, 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 in every, every, every island. Sandy Island, any island. Yeah, man. Between Ireland, Finland, Scotland, any land. He has a wealth of experience. As he goes to for a quick single, it was well handled. And you can see the difference between the Ahoma and the Upsetters team. With the Upsetters, they were just flashing at everything. You know, like lightning, they were just flashing, like some bad weather. But the Homer, they are very watchful. Getting used to the pace and the bounce of the wicket. Young star again. Oh, well bold. And the keeper is, the keeper is sharpened behind it. That is, that, that blades, huh? That man sharpened like a razor, so. You well sharpened. Well sharpened, man. Remember, we are streaming live on Facebook. Brendan Blaze has sharpened like a razor. Young star again. Oh, that was a quickie. That was a quickie. And David wanna dive. Well stopped. It was stopped. That was a brilliant piece of feeling on the boundary line there from David Warner. Hence the reason that upset has brought him all the way from Australia. He, he rode the boat for six weeks to get here. Came by boat. Two months, what's two months? Two months? Oh, yeah, two months, yeah. I thought it was six weeks. I thought that a month or two weeks only. <laughs> That's it. Oh, jail time, jail time, jail time we're talking. Yeah. So at the end of over number one, a woman. Yeah. One. That was a good over there from upsetters. They realized that. They doesn't have much to play with it, they doesn't have much to defend. So they are applying the pressure on a homer. Name of the bowler, name of the bowler, please. Name of the bowler. Name of the bowler. Name of the bowler. Hello, what is 
Alright, so we're gonna walk on that. Let's go, let's go, let's play. Play. So we do the second over. Upset that are bowling behind well that bowler is bowling behind his back. <laughs> he needs to bowl in front. That was a mishap though. That was an accident, an incident at the same time. So we have to reload this one. He's back at the top of his mark. Running in fast and a shoy back tap. And Bolton, that's a big hit from Cole. That's a big hit from Handel. I tell you, Handel is full of experience. He's full of class. He was down on his knees and hitting over the mid wicket boundary for six rounds. That is 105 meters. One of the biggest six we have seen for the day. Yeah, one of, one of. It wasn't the biggest. The biggest was recorded at 115. So setters have to look to get handled all because he's aggressive, he's an aggressive batsman. Yes, so be mindful in the power play, that's the power play, that's the second over in the power play. When you hit in the V, you get double. So we encourage the batsman to play straight, not across the line. So that was a good comeback there from, from the bowler. He runs in again, past the umpire. Oh, and that was a quick one, but it's a no ball. It's a no ball. Struck in the head. Struck in the head. Struck in the head. But it seems to be okay. Someone can just bring out the helmet. We want no head injury here tonight. Just can I bring out the helmet? That young man is pacey. He's aggressive. He's sharp. He's sharp. And again, oh, well defended there. Well defended. That's that's what experience can do do for you. And they go to for a quick single. So the score moves on to nine. Nine in one point five overs. And where are we? One point four overs. So upsetters at the moment seems to be on top of things. Let us see if they can create the upset here tonight. Goes again, runs in. Oh, swing there from there. And I tell you, this young man is fast. And I stare at the batsman. They are applying the pressure very early, making use of the new ball. He runs in again and bowls. And it's not a good delivery, and not a swing from there on. But was a unable to connect this one, kept a bit low. He played above that delivery. So at the end of over number two, the score remains at nine. Nine without loss. So setters, they are applying the pressure very early here on a homer. That's what we love to see. Pick up everyone in the stands, pick up everyone in the pack. 
The numbers continue to rise. We are 25,000 at the moment. Almost filled to capacity. There goes the young man again, Pacey as well. Honda tried to steer this one. Down to the top man, Bongji, but was unable to connect. Goes through to the wicket keeper. These young guys, they are fast. That's express pace. They are running in fast and they are delivering and bowling fast. And not a fast delivery handle flip down the leg side. And they go to for a leg by. That's wrong. Seems to come off. Seems to come off the bat. The, the pattern. The tie pattern. No, the, the, the bat, sorry. So he runs in again. Oh, he misses right up. from that wicket keeper. He reminds me somewhat of Junior Mori. He's good and this is ex express space from that young star. This is this is one of the fastest deliveries we've seen here today. It's over a hundred. He runs in and bowls again. Oh same delivery, same spot, same result. There has no clue what is going on inside here. He has no answer for that young star. That is very impressive. This is one of the better bowlers we have seen in the competition so far. He's looking good. He comes again and bowls. Oh, oh well defended. They go to for a quick single. That is lovely bowling. Lovely bowling from that young star. <laughs> That's a, that's, I believe that's the first, first run and, and, and the over. How'd you score that Two. A leg by, yeah, that, a leg by. And... Comes in again, a ball to handle. Oh, down the leg side. That's why, well taken there by the keeper. Wide signal by there by umpire Kian. Billy Bowden. Yeah, Kian look like no, Kian don't look like Billy Bowden. That that look like um David Shepard, man. David Shepard. You look like David Shepard when you look at the posture. Yeah. You know that's a good shot there from Handel. Down the leg side, he. That's the only delivery that the bowler straight and Handel was able to put this one situations. He so he was able to put this one away over the final boundary. Six runs. Yes, when you look at Kian, you know, you remind me of Baby Shepard. That, 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 that umpire from England, I believe. You know, when you look at the belly. Yes. Umpire, umpire is umpire Bachner. Umpire Bachner. Steve Bachner. Yeah, that's Steve Bachner. Yeah. <laughs> Are you mischievous? Do that, Ricky. No. I see him. 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 I At the end of over number three. As he runs in again and bowls and swings down to the final boundary. But cut off there by the fielder. Back on a square. And they go through for a quick single. Upsetters. They are restricting their home and scoring at the moment. They are putting the pressure, applying the pressure. 
And this is what you need to do when you come up against you know, teams with the big names. So he comes in again and bowls. And Cold Swings is an opportunity for a catch. And oh, what a catch. What a catch. They really the catch. And David Warner, that, they, that they, they, they bring all the way from Australia, was able teams that are playing to catch this Oma. one. Of the rebound. And of setters. <laughs> And when we look at the celebration, that's an Australian celebration, I'm telling you. So we have Wani in Tibet. Wani, so after. Yes, back here live. We got Brendan Blazer, shopping like a razor. Check out his Facebook page. He's bringing the game live. And he top up his mark and runs in again. And go to one and one he swings. Six rounds. Over the extra cover region. Six rounds. That's a good start. That's a good start to Wally. The ball was in the slot. All he had to do was drive to the line, make connection, and the result is six rounds. The ball again comes in and bolts. Oh, it's a no ball, and it's an edge, but well fielded. Well fielded there on the third man boundary. It's a free hit. It's an opportunity to score a biggie. Remember, you cannot be out from a free from a free hit. <laughs> What's wrong? And he swings, but that was a good delivery. Oh, yes, that was you was on the right. Bouncing was rising. He keep on to take it up by his chest. Oh, to get me reference. And he was still rising. I catch that a lot on that one here. Mm -hmm. One big up CJ, Tyron Charles, a veteran in the football business. Big up yourself. Also in cricket. Oh, that's a lovely delivery. Peter for peace. And bounce. Only that one here in here. Watch it. The only thing I see. Upsetters. They are restricting our home and score here at the moment. There's a lot of dark balls in the evening, creating pressure, mounting up the pressure. And while it swings again, and it's gone, six rounds, another six. That one was in the slot. He said, did you? And one was able to put this one away over the long on boundary for six rounds. We have another shopping razor here. So we have Minix over there, and I think that is Astro coming. Astro? Oh, Supermax. That's Supermax. Yeah, I don't like Supermax. He ends up shopping. But you dead, and I didn't come up with the next one. But like, since two days, I'm going to tell you nothing. <laughs> That. I smell you at. Oh, why are you in the end? I was in the end, the gimbal. Oh, so where are you at? You're dressed up. And that? Oh, you're about to be dead, so you fell down. She rode it around wide like an ant. It's four after four overs. It's um, yeah. 33, 31, 32, I believe. It's a white ball. Where are you? signal there. Alright, go back right. Pick up yourself, Supermax. She's in Kenya, she's money. 
Chigi ke ni ashi moni. I have money for this. Anyway, this can not be. Where will I go? This can not be money. Have I? Wow, ladies and gentlemen, you realize it was a bit shaky a while ago. Oh, well, Bold. I'm telling you, up top, up, up, so up, up, there, on top of things here. You remember, probably, you come in, maybe come with Otto. They are boring to the field. Yeah. They are exploiting the wicked very well. Hmm? You will tell me, you want to so check after four overs, 4.2 overs, a homer, they are 33. I want land first, man. I don't want for one. Land. You know, I want land. I don't know. Oh, point one, sorry. My you buy that? I don't even want it. I don't want to make him out. Man, I don't know who. Go. Man, let me just sit out on the live. Eh? Yeah, but the doctor I was going to say, I don't know who will die first. <laughs> yes. So one is, one is doing it here for a homer. Reg. Okay. It's very impressive at the moment. Camera. You cut off if you don't hear him, no? Show me press. And he swings again. That's a great shot. That's an opportunity for a catch. But somehow, I believe that the player lost sight of that ball as he get closer to him. He was unable to make an, a, a good effort. But one is playing with some, some glorious shot here. He's playing some expensive and expansive shot. He's up to the task. Sending a message to upsetters. Saying that a homer is not going down without a fight. And there it goes again. And that's six. That's six. From the moment he left the bat, we know that it was six runs. He played through the line. Straight back with a straight back. High elbow. Six runs. One for the one for the textbook from the textbook. And a fellow friend with Prosperous Shell. Top right now. Yes, you're young people, so you can go see. Oh, it's another drive again. Well filled in there by the by the field along on the long of long on boundary. And they failed to go to for a quick single. What is the point? What is the point? Point standing. At and at the end of over number five, at the end of over number five, the score is huh? 47. 47. 47 to what? I don't want to battle. I'll not battle about this. Asking the organizers, please um, try and get the, the covers in case there is rain. So we can cover the pitch. I don't think we're going to wait for now. We can get a couple guys to assist in that department. So that we can cover the pitch. To ensure that the games, that the game finish, in case there is a rain, we are filling a couple drops already. Six overs. How much do I have to make? 98? 99? No, it's something about it. 
Maybe you know, it's one. I want a brick of bar in you. Yeah, I feel I take this, the one. No, what you, you, can't, you cannot, you cannot admit that it was a fool. Yes. 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 Who? Remus. Hey, good night, Remus. <laughs> I don't hear me keep back now. Sorry. Thomas. Yes, um, yeah. Remus. Yeah. Remus. Why? Good night, I'm Remus. I'll be a lot of boys. Got back to the car. I tag back some. Next one. Oh God. Oh, listen. Yeah, you know, then those back people do. But I had to go with the whole squad for him. What are you catching? What are you taking? What are you going to do? I tell him, let me do the child. Cheesy data. You have to say. If GBN want to get on you, what she do? I don't know what she do, but I hear you have some cough and some. I say it on the light, but I don't care what that. The little one. Not the small one, the one before the last one. The one for the if you like body goes. For me, 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 for I don't care what I'm speech. Yeah, but you're It was done. What well, was the time? It was done. Everybody sees. Is somebody that tell me? Yes, yeah, she, she may look fine. It's not that. Is it? Is it? What else? Because you have a word that was used. The degree? No, no, you have a word that was used. Is it come around? Or sometimes it almost happened to him. You, you see, you don't understand. You don't know the story behind the rash. And we have to But you could have handled it better. I find ah! you were not there. You run, 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 run,
I just, I just said that. This is not alleged. What? What is alleged? You get the one again. It is not. It is not confirmed. I just hear news. So then, don't report. I report it. I, I, I have third party. Hey, guys. Go, go, Ronnie, go. Easy, yeah. Make sure you get it. But every, what is it? Every action has a reaction. So you didn't, you didn't return. Easy, yeah. Follow me. Yeah, yeah, I know. Jerry. I want you there. I don't know. Pio. Wait, wait. Who there? You don't want to be big. Watch. Well, you want one more point? Watch. Oh. Oh. I see two there. They're just one more again. Like two. What do you want? No man. Wani. Wani. You don't have to be big. I'm not kidding around now. See what I did? You get done. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. What do you buy? Yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, Homer versus Upsetters. Um, I think we have one more game. I think we have one more game. So we will get some music from the DJ. And we'll be right back. Alright? So let me go for yourself.